Hello, and thank you for your interest in the STARS Route 123 and Old Bridge Road intersection study. This study was undertaken as a part of VDOT's Strategically Targeted Affordable Roadway Solutions Program, also known as the STARS Program. This is a joint effort between VDOT and Prince William County and serves as the main public outreach for this study to gain public input on potential improvements. This STARS study is assessing potential operational and safety improvements at the intersection of Virginia Route 123 or Gordon Boulevard, and Old Bridge Road in Woodbridge, Virginia. It has been conducted as part of a larger study of the Route 123 corridor, where potential improvements are being assessed at both I-95 exit 160 and at the US Route 1 and Route 123 intersection. This video focuses on the Old Bridge Road intersection, but additional public outreach was recently completed for these other two locations. Information on potential improvements for the I-95 interchange and Route 1 intersection can be found on the study website. The purpose of this study is to consider and evaluate potential intersection improvements to address safety and operational conditions. The study team analyzed current and future conditions to propose potential improvements. Historical crash data was analyzed, and safety issues include weaving movements on northbound Route 123 from the southbound I-95 ramp to Old Bridge Road, southbound Route 123 backups, through the Old Bridge Road intersection and lane changing approaching southbound I-95, and angle crashes at intersections in the study area. The current intersection configuration contributes to multiple hours of congestion on both Route 123 and Old Bridge Road throughout the day. At-grade intersection concepts, such as improving turn lanes and modifying traffic signals, as well as grade-separated concepts, such as bridges, ramps, and interchanges, have been evaluated. Fully at-grade concepts would not support the long-term capacity needs of the study area. There have been recent projects and studies completed or underway within the study area, and these were taken into consideration for this study. In 2018, Prince William County completed the Old Bridge Road Corridor Study, which identified needed safety and mobility improvements for the corridor between Prince William Parkway and Route 123. Preliminary improvements were identified for the Route 123 and Old Bridge Road intersection, including a flyover ramp. This concept was further refined as one of the alternatives under consideration in the current STAR study. Improvements to the intersection of Old Bridge Road and Occoquan Road are funded and currently in design. This project will remove the sharp curve along Old Bridge Road, add a southbound turn lane, and construct a new pedestrian crosswalk to improve safety and traffic flow. The study team has conducted analyses of several important concepts. The no-build alternative, used as a baseline comparison, represents how the network is expected to operate under future conditions with no additional changes aside from the Old Bridge Road, Occoquan Road intersection improvements. Four potential build alternatives are expected to improve safety and mobility by eliminating the northbound Route 123 weaving movement between southbound I-85 and Old Bridge Road, enhancing pedestrian and bicycle networks, reducing congestion on Route 123 and Old Bridge Road, and improving transit operations. Potential improvements for the I-95 interchange can be viewed on the study website. The Old Bridge Road intersection is expected to benefit from these potential I-95 interchange improvements, such as widening the southbound Route 123 ramp to southbound I-95 to two lanes. The first alternative, outside-outside flyover, consists of a new flyover ramp from the outside two lanes of Route 123 to the outside two lanes of Old Bridge Road to replace the existing three left turn lanes. This will also eliminate the unsafe weaving movement from southbound I-95. Traffic from the flyover can enter the commuter lot by crossing Old Bridge Road at a traffic signal. Northbound Route 123 is widened to three lanes through the intersection to tie into the existing three lane section north of Riverview Lane. The traffic signal remains for all other movements and pedestrian crossings. The traffic signal at Devil's Reach Road is removed and the median opening is closed to improve safety and traffic flow between I-95 and Old Bridge Road. Along Old Bridge Road, the median opening at the gas station is closed to provide additional storage for vehicles turning left onto northbound Route 123. The crosswalk at the commuter lot driveway remains and flyover traffic is stopped to allow pedestrians to cross safely. At all other times, flyover traffic remains free flow. A shared use path is added along northbound Route 123 and crosses to southbound Route 123 at the intersection. This aligns with future path connections to the north and south. 
sidewalk on the north side of Old Bridge Road is relocated outside of the flyover. Existing sidewalks remain in all other areas. The second alternative, outside-inside flyover, consists of a new flyover ramp from the outside two lanes of Route 123 to the inside two lanes of Old Bridge Road to replace the existing three left turn lanes. This will also eliminate the unsafe weaving movement from southbound I-95. Traffic from the flyover can enter the commuter lot by turning left across Old Bridge Road at a traffic signal. The right turn from southbound Route 123 to Old Bridge Road is relocated to the outside of the flyover to bypass the traffic signal. Northbound Route 123 is widened to three lanes through the intersection to tie into the existing three-lane section north of Riverview Lane. The traffic signal remains for all other movements and pedestrian crossings. The traffic signal at Devil's Reach Road is removed and the median opening is closed to improve safety and traffic flow between I-95 and Old Bridge Road. Along Old Bridge Road, the crosswalk at the commuter lot driveway remains and traffic from southbound Route 123 is stopped to allow pedestrians to cross safely. At all other times, right turn traffic remains free flow. Like the previous alternative, a shared use path is added along northbound Route 123 and crosses to southbound Route 123 at the intersection, and the sidewalk on the north side of Old Bridge Road is relocated outside of the flyover. Existing sidewalks remain in all other areas. The third alternative, grade separated, adds a new four lane bridge over Old Bridge Road for Route 123 through traffic, allowing these movements to bypass the traffic signal. A traffic signal will remain under the bridge for turns to and from Old Bridge Road and for pedestrian crossings. All traffic from southbound I-95 will also travel through the intersection to eliminate the unsafe weaving movement between I-95 and Old Bridge Road. Along Old Bridge Road, the median opening at the gas station is closed to provide additional capacity for vehicles turning left to northbound Route 123. The traffic signal at Devil's Reach Road is removed and the median opening is closed to improve safety and traffic flow between I-95 and Old Bridge Road. Median openings at Admiral Drive and Riverview Lane are also closed, and a U-turn movement is added under the bridge to maintain access. U-turns can also be made at the Commerce Street traffic signal. Due to changes in elevation required for the bridge, the existing commuter lot driveway on southbound Route 123 is closed, and traffic is rerouted to the driveway on Old Bridge Road. A shared use path is added along northbound Route 123 and crosses to southbound Route 123 under the bridge. This will connect with the existing path at Commerce Street into Fairfax County and aligns with future path connections to the south. Sidewalks are maintained on the opposite side of Route 123. The fourth alternative, elevated left turns, adds ramps and a grade separated interchange for left turns from northbound Route 123 to westbound Old Bridge Road and from eastbound Old Bridge Road to northbound Route 123. All traffic coming from southbound I-95 will also travel through the intersection to eliminate the unsafe weaving movement between I-95 and Old Bridge Road. The right turn from southbound Route 123 to Old Bridge Road is relocated to outside of the elevated ramps to bypass the traffic signal. The existing traffic signal remains for Route 123 through movements, right turns from Old Bridge Road, and pedestrian crossings. The traffic signal at Devil's Reach Road is removed and the median opening is closed to improve safety and traffic flow between I-95 and Old Bridge Road. The median opening at Admiral Drive is also closed and turns into and out of Riverview Lane are made from the northbound ramp. The southbound left turn is prohibited and local traffic is rerouted to Poplar Lane. Along Old Bridge Road, the existing traffic signal at the commuter lot driveway is relocated to a new access road to provide additional distance from the Route 123 traffic signals. A shared use path is added along northbound Route 123 and crosses to southbound Route 123 via a tunnel under the ramp and a signalized crosswalk across Route 123. This will connect with the existing path at Commerce Street into Fairfax County and aligns with future path connections to the south. Sidewalks are maintained on the opposite side of Route 123 and the sidewalk on the north side of Old Bridge Road is relocated outside of the ramps. The alternatives were evaluated relative to each other in various categories, including access and connectivity, safety, congestion relief, and cost. 
Darker shades of green in this graphic represent greater positive impacts or benefits. Transit access and connectivity considered improvements to transit operations and access to the commuter lot and bus stops. All build alternatives improve bus speeds and maintain access to the commuter lot with some traffic rerouting to the entrance on Old Bridge Road. The grade separated alternative impacts the entrance and bus stop on southbound Route 123. Pedestrian and bicycle connectivity considered the amount of new sidewalks or paths. The grade separated alternative provides the most direct connectivity and shortest crossings, while the elevated left turns creates a less pedestrian friendly environment with elevated ramps and walls. Vehicle access and connectivity considered ease of access to local properties and rerouted movements. The grade separated and elevated left turns alternatives have more rerouted movements with the closure of multiple median openings to provide more safety and operations benefits. Pedestrian and bicycle safety considered road crossings. The flyover, outside outside, and grade separated alternatives have crossings controlled by traffic signals and are considered safer than uncontrolled crossing. The other two build alternatives have one uncontrolled crossing of the southbound Route 123 right turn lane. Vehicle safety considered conflicting movements at intersections. All alternatives improve safety by separating one or more major movements from the existing intersection, eliminating the weaving movement from southbound I-95 to Old Bridge Road, and relieving future backups onto I-95 caused by the traffic signals on Route 123. The grade separated and elevated left turns alternatives separate multiple high volume conflicts. Congestion relief considered improvements to future traffic flow in the area. All four build alternatives are expected to provide reduced travel time and backups along Route 123 and Old Bridge Road. The grade separated alternative is expected to result in slightly better traffic flow through the area compared to the other build alternatives. Benefits can be compared with costs. The flyover, outside outside, is the lowest cost of the four build alternatives, and the grade separated and elevated left turns are the highest cost because they contain the most infrastructure. Thank you for taking the time to learn about the STARS Route 123 and Old Bridge Road intersection study. For more information about the study and the proposed improvements, please visit the VDOT Project website at www.virginiadot.org slash Woodbridge Stars. We welcome your feedback on the alternatives under consideration and encourage you to fill out the survey available on that same page. You may also provide comments by emailing meetingcomments at v.virginia.gov. Please put Route 123 and Old Bridge Road STARS study in the subject line. The survey and comment period will extend through July 6th. Once your feedback is collected, VDOT and Prince William County will identify a preferred alternative project funding as the improvements are not yet fully funded, and seek the advancement of the project. Your feedback is very important to us, so please take the opportunity to complete the survey and make sure your voice is heard.